I love these PlayStation style graphic games. Uh Oh shit. That's pretty dope, actually. I really like that. You can change her like you got PS1, 2, and 3 here. I'm assuming that's quit. I'm assuming it's quit. Okay. This game looked a lot of fun. I don't know if it's a demo too or not. I'm oh I gotta play as a nine year old girl. I think. Living the dream. I don't know anything but the villa for now. Last night while they used us, a spirit taught me what it would be like to live. Last night while they used us. Last night while they used us. Spirit taught me what it. Last night when they used us. Last night while they used us. I just purged myself of all that disgusting last night. And I can't be. I just purged myself of all that disgusting last. Did she just put her diary in the toilet? What the fuck? Uh, all right. So we got the old style Silent Hill Resident Evil controls. And it's actually, the controls are pretty like solid. Like, these are pretty tight controls, I ain't gonna lie. I can, I can like, fucking do a 12-point turn here. I can parallel Parker in the toilet. Uh, let's see. E to interact. Perfect, perfect. Okie dokie. We're just gonna ignore all the dead children. For now. We'll come back to it later. We got the run movements. Yo, this is some pretty good controls. So I don't know what I'm doing. I... <laughs> Camera angles are terrible. That's like very, uh, very PlayStation 2 there where they would do like the security camera look and it'd be all kinds of fucked up. This ain't Minecraft. This is PS2, son. Doesn't have pre rendered background suit, right? Alright, so I think. Am I the spirit trying to help her? Everything's oddly bright. No? Okay. She kind of looks like Cloud from Final Fantasy, doesn't she? Oh shit, now I'm packing. Check out that RTX, that ray tracing? Oh, fuck. Um, how am I gonna get out of here? Oh <laughs> uh, shit. Okay, can I? She looks like the girl. Oh, oh, what is... Auto mod stopped you from being able to say, looks like the girl. Auto mod held that, saying it was inappropriate. She does look like the girl from Silent Hill 3. Um, I also think we're... I think this is it, though. Can I... Oh, you gotta... You gotta dodge the door. <laughs> Okie dokie. Well, you know, it's good to know that now, though. Oh shit, am I supposed to eat? I have a cursor. Am I supposed to click on stuff? Ah, I guess. What do you think, guys? Shit, we fork him? Hold F. Sure. Am I gonna dome him? Get him again! Get him again! Yeah, get him in the neck! Oh, keep going. This is easily... This is easily the best game I've ever played. I have always, my whole life, I've played a lot of horror games, and I've always been like, I wish I was a small child murdering people with forks. It's a, it's a dream come true. Oh yeah, it's E. I was pressing F more. I wanted to stab the guy. Oh wait, did you get rid of the... F no, pick the fork back up. I also... Do I have an inventory or something? No, no. Oh shit. No! Oh, if you hit escape, it just starts over. Oh. Fuck. Okay. 
God damn it. All right, don't hit escape. I was trying to figure out if I had an inventory. I thought I picked up, like, a second fork or, you know, I don't know, a spoon or something crazy like that. Well. That's what I want to hang above my bathroom. The purger. I don't know if this is intentionally written to be creepy, or if it's by like a foreign develop- like someone who's not- English is not their primary language, and it just turned out to sound creepy as fuck when they tried to translate it. Cause I'm, I'm starting to think that maybe they're Russian or something, and they tried to translate it into English and just made it awesome. I was trying to think of what else that could mean. Why they, why they used us? Like what else it could mean instead of something horrible? Um. It could have meant, like, I don't know. Also, I, I was gonna, oh yeah, let's check uh, Purger number two. Let's see what we got going on in here. Oh, you gotta watch out for these doors, they are violent. I don't know what else it could have meant, but I, I feel like it probably was a translation error, maybe? That just turned out to be inadvertently creepy. Whoa. Alright. Now I have to remember where I went. Okay, that door's locked. Okay, and then there was this one, I believe. Yeah, because I went into this room, got the fork. Let's explore a little bit more before we kill that guy again. It is actually surprising how good these controls are. Cause I played a lot of PS1, PS2 games that were very, like the movement was like this, but they were fucking absolute shit. Can I not? All right, I don't think I can interact with the well. Oh, you know, we didn't try to stab any of my friends either. Nothing in there. That's the purger. All right, can I stab these kids? Nope. Used, abused, and stuffed in a porta potty. I don't like. Don't say that. <laughs> that's probably what happened, but I just want to pretend that's not what happened. Uh, let's let's like assume it was something not fucked up. Like they just put demons in us or something, or, or you know maybe they were just using our blood for some kind of ritual. Spooky boozy, what's going on, Apollo? You came at the just best point. I'm a nine year old girl. Get him. Oh. Yeah, one more for good measure. Thank you. This is predictable. <laughs> oh, it's so predictable. You just knew that it was going to be a nine-year-old shanking someone. That is out of Minecraft, isn't it? That skeleton? A violent child? Fuck yeah, dude. I think that image is actually... that. I've seen that image before. Oh, there's another door back here. Oh, let's get fucked up! Oh, ho, ho, ho. tender. Oh, she's already holding it like she's fucking ready to shank. That's a classical painting. I can't quite remember the artist. Oh, is it really? Oh, okay. That's why I've seen it like a bunch before. Couldn't put my finger on it. The more people you murder, the darker your hair gets? No. Wait, really? No, you're full of shit. Oh, wait. Did it really? Now I don't know. It might be... Oh. You got a slow walk. Hi, buddy. Oh! We're going hard. <laughs> I, I'm starting to think, yeah, when they when she said I was a nine year old girl, and after they used us last night, I'm thinking, yeah, it was, it was not the, like, I don't want to talk about it anymore. 
Let's just keep murdering these people. Look at that face. Just... What? How would you even write a review for this game? What the fuck would you even say? Pull the Master Sword out, Link. Oh, holy shit. The music's getting, uh, worse. Oh, okay, it's locked. Uh, let's, let's head to the left first. Oh, the, it's a wall. Never mind. Okay, let's just go through here. Young girl goes through puberty in a unique way. Yeah, I suppose. Did I lose? 7 out of 10, the closest thing we'll ever get to a Lizzie Borden simulator. Nice, creepy 9 year old, dead face killing random people. I don't know if they're random. I think I just lost, too. I think like, is this like a stealth survival game? Am, am I Metal Gear? <laughs> Holy shit. I wonder how else this game can surprise us now, though. Game, you played your cards too quick. You played your hand too quick. Rip. All right. Oh, wait. I don't know why, but I want to see if I can put the fork into the back of the TV. Okay, no, you can't. Shoot, boop, 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 boop. I'm just a kid. Just a kid with a fork. I think her hair did get a little darker, but I don't think that was uh, supposed to be blood or anything. At first I thought it was dope, but Dick Salmon made me really question this game. Because I thought maybe she was part of some kind of psycho cult or something. Which, I mean, probably still is. Use all your brain power to st <laughs> just have the fork into this. Maybe, uh, maybe she's psychic, you know? And, like, brain power is so she can overpower... Because, honestly, she just overpowered a grown man with a fork. Yeah, I know that would hurt, but you'd be able to, like, backhand that kid and be like, Fuck out of here with your fork, so... When you run through the blood that spurts out, her hair got darker. Okay, so it, I, yeah, maybe it's intentional. It just, it's so much more fun to just strut, you know, to not run, to just take my time. So, I think this girl's a demon, just for the fact that she, oh, wait, I gotta walk the, oh, shit. Uh, she knows, like, how to cut the Achilles tendon just perfectly. You know what I mean? Oh, is this the guy I forgot to kill last time and he was the one that got alerted? I don't fucking know. I also forgot to change the title. Oh, well. Bathe in the blood. Uh, do we want to go out? So I'm assuming I gotta kill everyone in this in this game in a specific orb. Uh oh, he's got a little Susie in there. It's okay, little Susie. We'll take care of him. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's going for the dick again. Look at that face. It's just so just just chilling. Okay. Oh, it does get darker. Yeah. So I can't. Uh, can't save her, I guess, but well, at least he's dead. I have a lot of questions for this dev, but I don't want to ask any of them. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> I'm assuming there's nothing else over here. Okay, let's go on. So yeah, I'm assuming I have to kill everyone in a like a, in a certain order, or else like they'll wake up or something. Oh wait, nope, I gotta go. Ooh. Make a U-turn quick. Hang right. Ah uh, shit. Was it this room had a guy in it? Yes, it was. Yeah, this is brain doming. 
That reminds me of the, uh, the girl from <clears throat> Kill Bill, the Asian one, Lucy Liu. I can't think of her name in the, in the movie. But she, like, hid under the bed and stabbed that guy through the bed. You remember that? Why can't I? Oh, there we go. Uh, Dismembered? I believe the game is. Dismember, maybe? Nine-year-old wouldn't be strong enough to stab through someone's skull. That's what I was saying! Not only would she not be strong enough to stab through the skull, she wouldn't... I, I wouldn't think they would know how to cut the Achilles tendon. You know? I mean, if she is possessed... Like, if, if you're possessed by a demon, but the demon is helping you kill, like... Fuck up, motherfuckers. Is it really that bad of a demon? I, I'm... Oop. Let me position myself. Oh, I didn't hold F that time. Guess it did. Oh, he's smiling that whole time, too. Holy shit, you really did not read the synopsis for this game, did you? No, I didn't. I just looked at it and I saw it was a PlayStation 2 game. It looked creepy, so I was like, fuck yeah. Is it fucked up synopsis? Do I want to know the synopsis? Hold on a second, I gotta kill this guy. Uh, Zoe, adopted at age 5, sold to the villa to vent to millionaire men seeking intimacy with young girls captivated. So Zoe turned 9 one day, and she and the other 15 girls who lived there with her were abused? That's... Okay. Zoe, adopted at age... It could still be a translation error. Yeah, because that, that was a poorly written sentence. Um... Is that everybody? Oh shit, now my camera just... Uh, I don't know which way I went. Okay, I killed all these guys. Shit. I'm all kinds of confused now. The camera like fucked with me for a second there. Alright, so is there any items... Yeah, let's still pray it's a translation error. Okay. Um, I think, uh, I'm assuming I can go back outside now. Should I not be running? Should I be trying to be sneaky? I mean, I just did murder a lot of people. I don't think there's any more time to sneak. So, basically what you're saying is I'm at Epstein's private island right now. Could be because the developer's main language appears to be Spanish. Okay. This is like, <laughs> this is Epstein's villa. Okay, I was already in there killing people. Where was that door that was locked? Did, did I get the key for that door? I hope all those kids are just sleeping. You know, just snoozing. This door won't open. Is this the one that was locked? It's not, hmm. I'd say Google Translate is pretty good with Spanish, so I 100% think Epstein's private. Oh yeah, 100% Epstein's private island. Oh, I think it was this one. Okay, so I'm I'm obviously missing something here. Something of of the key like variety. Wait, did I need to go in this room? I don't think there was anything in there. No. Okay. All right, let's check all these rooms again. I must have missed... I know I picked up a couple items, but I just don't know what they did. I couldn't really tell what they were. Right, Gameplay-wise, not the best game. Story-wise and just fucked upness. I'm feeling it. Oh. Okay, I'm just sticking to the left, because I missed a key or something. The only place I can assume to go to is that one door. And I'm assuming I gotta find a key for that one door somewhere. Let's try, like, oh. I, I'm also wondering if I'm, I have a cursor. Like, it's not the normal default cursor, so. I'm trying to think if there's something I'm supposed to do. Like, click on or something. You got distracted by your back? Oh, dude, did you get to see me stabbing Epstein in the cock with a knife? Oh, damn it, door. 
Gotta watch out for these doors, man. This is this is a lot darker than PS1 Silent Hill shit, man. A lot darker. So I guess I should try. Can't click on anything. I can't I can't imagine that the cursor does anything. I wonder if there's any music cues for Oh yeah, because it does do the like this weird music cue where it's like ching 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 ching. Ah, it's okay. You don't need them. Oh, that that glowing thing right there that I missed. It's okay, Apollo. They probably wouldn't even visit you if you were in the hospital. Okay, so I'm assuming I got the key for that other door then. Why is the playground indoors? They're not even like the- oh shit. Oh! Okay. So a few minor complaints, like the camera angle, sometimes I just can't- they don't switch to anything. Okay, that looks like an item. Am I supposed to pick that up? Do I click on it? I think the music just gets darker the more you progress. I don't know if that is an item or not. I don't think it is. Wait a minute, did I just open that door the other way? Or did I close it? Oh, I opened the door into the into the wall. Are you in a hospital get I'm in Epstein's private island. Oh, oh you were talking about your cousin. I thought you were talking about me in a hospital. Oh Jesus fuck. That actually startled me a bit. I was not ready for that. I think I fucked up the trigger there. By opening that door twice like that. Oh. Uh. We're stuck. Yeah. Yep, yeah, we're stuck. Okay. Damn it. Do we have to restart? So I think I accidentally. I was trying to see if that was an item on the ground. And so I opened the door once, opened the door again through the wall, and then I think, like, I reached into the wall to try to grab the door again, and now I'm stuck in the wall. You have a few issues with the game, Butterman? Yeah, okay. Damn it. It also does kind of suck you can't, like, pause it. Because if you hit escape, I guess you, I guess you don't really need to pause it. Yeah, no save points kind of sucks. Yeah, for sure. This will be the third start now, because I didn't know if I hit escape, it just ends the game. But we should be able to speedrun it pretty good now. I wish you could skip this cutscene. Yeah, but I get to see all the fun bits. That's right. You know, in all honesty, I like how she's writing in her diary and then just pushes it into the toilet. She's like, do 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 do, boop. Now I'm gonna go kill people. Uh, <laughs> she got possessed by a cat. Just light taps, slight taps, knocks it in. Uh, yeah, I mean, it needs it needs polish for sure, but I mean. Is this a, uh, this isn't a demo, is it? No, this is probably the full game, I think. Do, 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 do. Was it this? Yeah, he's in here, isn't he? Oh, no, he's not. He's in the next room. See, now I'm gonna fuck up and forget, like, 
where all the guys are and like not accidentally not murder someone, you know? Dear Dyer, you should have received much blood on this day. Maybe it's worse than the end of the Here's hoping. Tee hee. So she doesn't, she doesn't actually kill him with the fork. It looks like she like forks him to hold him in place and then with the other hand snaps his fucking neck. I don't think she actually kills him with the fork. And then I pick up this thing, which I'm assuming is a key. Oh my god, I can run backwards. Do 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 do. All right, then we go in here into the kitchen. So I think the last guy I have to kill is the guy with the key. So you gotta go room to room, murder at everybody. So I gotta, no, I gotta go down the hall to the left for the first murder. Okay, now kill this guy. Hello. This is your first dick stabbing, Bri. That's not the actual story, but it's the, the story is uh, these millionaires kidnap little girls and uh, it doesn't specifically say what they're using them for, just that they're using them. And then they purge themselves of evil. So this little girl can fully stab a knife right through a skull like 14 times. Wee. All right, now I think. Uh, I mean, I think there's just someone in every room. I think we just go to every room, murdering. Just every room. Sold to a villa and went to millionaire men seeking intimacy with young girls. I mean, I guess it could mean cuddling. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't necessarily mean sex. It could mean deep conversations. What? Fucking what? God damn it. They play games to the they were, <laughs> Intimacy is actually a board game, and they're just looking for people to play. <laughs> this is so fucked up. Oh, god damn it. And all the girls you see are so tired because they're up all night having TV conversations. And this this girl didn't get to stay up late because she lost first. Like she was like the first one out in Monopoly, so then she's just pissed. I wonder I wonder what's worse, the the actual storyline or what we're turning the storyline into. Okay, so there's definitely a certain order you have to kill these guys. I I wasn't paying very much attention the first time we got through it. This guy was just doing laundry and she stabs him with the fork, yeah. Doing laundry because, like, they, they, they were having so much fun they accidentally spilled juice on themselves. So he was being nice and washing their clothes. Man, I remember puberty being pretty bad, but not kill everyone on, on the property. I don't think puberty has anything to do with it. I don't think puberty is why she's doing this. I think it's board games. Honestly. I mean, have you guys ever played... Oh, are you just not supposed to run at them? Maybe you're just not supposed to run at them. Maybe that's what I was doing wrong. So, yeah, but have you ever been, like, at a family gathering? Well, I mean, your family doesn't pay attention to you, but, like... You've heard of family gatherings, and you've been playing Risk or something, and, and your family just kills you right away, and then they play Risk for the next, like, four hours without you. Yeah, that's what's happening here, you know? My family hasn't been in the same room in five years. <laughs> it's like, if you're doing laundry and someone comes in, like, winter, you just dive out the window. I mean, she's got to be possessed by a demon. She somehow overpowers this grown man choking the shit out of her. Just snap his neck with a fork. A yeet off the second floor. Get away from me. So yeah, I think I think maybe my issue is that I'm running. Because I, I think I was being dramatic and just walking last time. And that's how I, how I got through all this. I don't remember. 
Tell you what, I was very tired. I played that first game. Still very tired. Play this game, not so tired anymore. Her walk animation is casual. Well, so's her face. She's that's got that face of like when your parents' friends say like, "Oh, Susie, look how grown up you are," and you're like, "Hmm, yeah." Hey, what's I don't know him. And I'm like, Susie, don't you remember John and Kathy? Like they went to church with us when you were just a little kid. Or your parents try to get you to remember someone that you met when you were like two. You're like, I don't fucking remember them. But they were my, my first year Sunday school teacher. Fuck, I don't know who they are. Oh, shit, I was holding up. That's the face. Like, watch when she stabs in the dick. It's just like, Mom, I don't remember him. Yeah. Every freaking time. That's like, oh, you remember Susan? She worked at the grocery store when you were born, and then you never saw her again. How don't you remember Susan? That's the face you give to your parents. That face right there. Just like, yeah, Mom, Susan, that's cool. Sun's, dude, her backwards walk is casual. It's like she's about to slide up to an arcade cabinet and fucking nuke your ass at Mortal Kombat 2. Like, what up? You want to have a piece of this shit, bitch? Hmm. I, I dare sway she's got, say she's got sway. This is how we deal with Susan. Damn it, Susan, you put the eggs on the bottom of the bag! This whole, this whole game has just gone off the rails. It's gone so fucking downhill. I don't even know what we're talking about anymore. Dude, just that, that swag she's got going from that room like, Yeah, I killed him. Mm, little strut. Just heading over to the next room over. Hello! Housekeeping! Oh, sometimes the trigger's a little weird. Come on. There we go. I gotta say, after hearing this music for, what's it been, a half an hour now? It's starting to fuck with me. Alright, this is where I fucked up last time. Oh, it is this area. Just this area cues the weird, staticky fucking shit. Also, by Skull 5, that knife is done. That knife is dull as fuck. She's basically, it's, it's gotta be completely blunt by now. And she's still just fucking getting it in there. She, oh! <laughs> I was trying to read chat and walked right in front of him. Excuse me. Come on. I need to get that. There we go. She's not maintaining her tools here, right? What the fuck? So, oh, that's why I didn't notice the key first. It's not there until you kill everyone. And then you have to go back and get the key. Okay, that's not, that's not counterintuitive at all. Oh, shit. Wait, was there not a hallway here? Shit, how do we, how do I get to the next guy? The guy in the bathroom. Uh, oh fuck. Where am I? These camera angles fuck you up sometimes. Probably assumes you'll, uh, oh, you'll kill him last. Oop. Alright, so now I can't remember how to get to the guy in the bathroom. It's, oh, is there another door over here? No? Was it the first door? Oh, maybe it was the very first door, and there's another... Is there another door at the end of this hallway? Oh, yeah, you probably are supposed to kill him last. That makes sense. Okay. I mean, I don't expect this free game about killing pedophiles to be fully... Fully functional, I guess? Is that the right word? Fully functional? We'll say it's fully functional. All right, now I gotta go back and get the key. Okie dokie. I'm so worried about running. Feature complete. Now. I like these, I, see I, I really do enjoy these short horror games. 
The ones you're supposed to finish in like an hour that are free, not the ones that you finish in an hour that are twenty dollars. <laughs> because it's it's a lot like reading no sleep or like creepy pastas. Where you read just a short snippet and they're creepy and they're good and they're some of them turn into like seventy four part series, but you know, that always gets me at night. Like I'm reading a no sleep before I go to bed, and I'm like, oh that was really good, and you get to the bottom, it's like part one of nine, and I was like, fuck! Now I gotta read the other fucking eight. Uh, the SCP game, uh, out of nowhere yesterday? I remember the SP SCP... Oh, is the game called Out of Nowhere? Or you just thought of it out of nowhere? I think I've only played a handful of SCP games that are really bad. Oh, no, 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 thought of it. There was that SCP survival game I played once that, like... <laughs> Someone like reported me to the mods of the server I was in saying I was cheating somehow Is is that the one where that guy like accused me of cheating and shit and got the mods involved? I don't know. There was a couple SCP. Oh fuck. This is that's right. I shouldn't have gone this way. Oh, here we go Let's go around this way Yeah, yeah, that one was pretty fun where each person was a different SCP and then they had like the facility and then other people Yeah, I remember that shit yeah, because I, I, I don't... Like, he shot at me. Or he shot me, and then I killed him. And then he got, like, super pissed off at me that I did that. And I was like, well, fuck, I don't know. I like how he's like, bring it on, you little bitch, and then he turns and walks away. It's like, mm. okay. So, am I supposed to do anything in, in this room? The guy, yeah, he joined the Discord and the, and the, and the Twitch stream. And he's just like, that was the guy that told me, that my mom told me to paint my wall blue. Or some weird shit like that. He's like, I bet your mom told you to paint the wall that color. I'm like, the fuck are you talking about? What kind of weird ass insult is that? Is this the guy that I'm supposed to bring it on to? <laughs> Am I supposed to get myself a Diet Coke while I'm in here? Yeah, it was really weird. Okay, I just picked something up. This is creepy. <laughs> just watching her slide across the screen with a knife. To proceed, have a refreshing Coca-Cola. I heard something. It's like in that other game where it's Hep C. Hep C brand cola. Alright, what the fuck was the key I just got for? Oh, maybe this door right over here that I should go look at. Oh, fuck. Now I'm really worried about dying because I don't want to start over. Oh, shit. I saw something in the top right. Whoa, Jesus. I don't know why that scared me. Wait, did I lose? Wait, oh, it does have a save point. <laughs> I like to think he just kicked me out. He was just like, eh. And just shut the door. And then put the key back on the chair. <laughs> God, why did that startle me? I've seen, I've played so many games with jump scares and shit, and an old guy walking at me fucking startled me. God damn it. I'm too tired to be playing horror games. Alright. <laughs> ah! Oh shit, am I supposed to... Am I supposed to try to sneak up behind him or something? We're expecting this not... <laughs> it's not what the game is known for. How dare you enter? I'd be pedophilia-ing in here. Uh, yeah, well, see, this is good. When a, when a horror game does this kind of thing where you're just not ready for it. You know, you're just chilling and you're laughing about things in the game and talking about the game and then dumb little things like a random piano or some shit scares you. Can I just... I'm gonna F the fuck out of you right now. Oh! Oh, she's, she's got a saw at it now because she's dulled the knife so fucking bad. Oh god, they all look exa- I do- I, I look so out of place. It's like 12 clones and then me. Oh shit. 
They all have so much blood in there. <laughs> the Little Psycho by Revoodoo. Why would you call her a little psycho then if she killed all these pedophiles? The mission uh, is not ruled out. I had multiple accomplices in the church. I'm trying to find a. Zoe will. Oh, I have a name! Zoe will be taking the children's reformatory to demonstrate that her physical and mental state is correct. If she alone could do it, that with just a knife, what would you have done? I don't know, taking her out to pizza? Give it, like. You go, Zoe! I would have put her up, like, in a, like, UFC. Or like, um, like a softball league or something. Girl's got fucking. She's got to have fucking guns, you know. Level two. What are we doing? <laughs> like they put me in the police car and then leave the leave the other fourteen girls just chilling outside. Why? Why? Why not just let Zoe be a badass? Why did you have to make her a demon? Or maybe she be Did her head just float out of the fucking police car? I think the police car drove away without her head for a second there. I'm pretty sure I seen it. You did good, Zoe. You done good. <laughs> 